wouldn't it be nice if we could automatically translate between different process modeling languages? Now we can translate from Wopet to YAWL. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and I make videos on business process automation. Today I'll show you a new feature of Wopet, the export to YAWL. Wopet and YAWL are two tools with different functionalities. In Wopet you can edit and simulate workflow nets. In YAWL you can automate business processes. Both tools have workflow nets as a common basis. So in the case that you have simulated a business process in Wopet, it may very well be that you want to continue automating it in YAWL. To facilitate the transition, there is now the possibility to save a Wopet net in the YAWL format. Let's see how this works. Okay, we have Wopet 3.9 or higher opened here on the right hand side and the first thing we want to do is to check in the configuration if everything is set to save files in the YAWL format. So in the configuration on the right hand side you have the YAWL tab and here you need to activate YAWL support if it's not yet activated and you need to activate export YBKP files with groups because we want to export the roles as well and we will not check export YAWL files with explicit conditions. This is something that we don't want to do and then we apply the settings and now we go to options and help and load one of the sample nets of Wopet and this one is called loan application resources. So we load that one and now you can see this net here it has resources and it's a small workflow specification. So the next step is to save this and we go to file save as and now we can save this in YAWL format and we will call this loan application resources We press save and then now you can see in this directory here we have loan application resources YAWL and we also have the YBKP file containing the resources. So next thing is we go to the top left now and here we are in the YAWL ad, uh, administration in the YAWL control center logged in as the administrator and we go to org data we click on this symbol here to import org data and now we choose this YBKP file we have just exported here. We import the file and then it tells us it has done this successfully. So we click OK and now we can see that we have the roles clerk, manager, office worker and secretary. And these are the roles that come from the WOPED specification. Okay, the next thing we'll do is we will take the YAWL file here and pull this into the YAWL editor. And now in the YAWL editor, if we click on register, for example, we go down to the resourcing here. And now we can see that this first task is offered to the office worker role. So the roles are inside. Now if we want to show the colors of the roles what we need to do is we need to first create decompositions for all the manual tasks in the net and then we can see that. So let me just do that and I start with the register task and I just go to new decomposition register and the same we will do for check form and finally 
archive. Now, if we go to this color roles by their ro color tasks by their roles, we get this legend and we we have the colored resources here in our net. And now you can compare to the original net and can see that office worker is the first task and the last task and secretary are these rejection and approval tasks and so on. Try this with your own WOPED nets and let me know in the comments if you think it is useful or not. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to stay tuned. See you next time.